Hey to Say Destiny crew, Carl Spreedy's here. Thanks for joining me for another Say Destiny Daily Dose. I've got Alpesh next to me. Hello, how are you guys going? Hope you guys are doing well. Today is decide to own your truth so that you can live in reality. So we were discussing this, weren't we, just a little while before, of how, how people will try and bend and move reality in a way that makes them comfortable. Because naturally, we're always looking for comfort. We're always looking for something that you know, doesn't you know, make us inconven- you know, inconvenienced you know, in a way. It's, so It's our tribe. We yeah. look for our tribe. And when we try and be part of this tribe, yeah. Um, we forego certain of our own truths just to uh, manipulate ourselves mm. in, and to try and fit ourselves into a tribe because we want to be part of this tribe rather than owning our own truth. And initially it sounds like a good idea because we all want to be part of this you know, clan, tribe, yeah. business, whatever we want that's to be how, part That's of. how we survived. Correct. Like, yeah, yeah. But if you own your own truth and actually really decided, I will be part of this tribe, but I'll be my true authentic self, will maybe give you more, um, uh, probably give you an idea of what um, you could give back being your authentic self. Mm. Because Everyone brings something true, different to the group. Correct. If, if you're trying to mold yourself, you disappoint yourself. Yes. Because at the end of it, you're not being your true authentic self. So you will, you will change uh, organically. And as you change organically, you soon lose reality or touch as to who you are. Mm. And if you're not a, your authentic self, and you've lost your authentic self, you're just one of the number. And I guess that will then remove you again from that feeling that you're a valuable member of the tribe, you're just yeah. in the tribe. Yes, and you know, whether it's the founding fathers or it's scientists or whoever it is, any group, they have people that are bringing totally different viewpoints, totally different perspective, totally different hypotheses to the organization, to the project, sorry, to the project so that the project can be a success. Because if you want to make an impenetrable, you know, like whether it's a design, um, whether it's a, you know, like a, a piece of legislation, whatever it is, you've got to get people that will poke holes at it from every different angle. Correct. So that you can actually properly beta test it before it actually goes out into the real world. And it's different opinions. And yeah. if, you, if you've got those different opinions of people who are true to themselves or true to who they are, and they it creates a more neutral outcome because you've got all the different opinions. But also you've got the other side of things, which is if you're not true to yourself and looking at it from a personal perspective or looking from your own self, once you start getting lost within the tribe, how do you then decide your worth hmm. within whatever community or tribe or business or whatever you are? So the truth starts to escape because you're not true yes. to yourself. Yeah, and I've seen top top CEOs that I've had interactions with myself who have tried to formulate a response about reality to avoid a real issue. And I was, I was telling to you before about it where it was, you know, I had to be the middleman and, and help out with a whole bunch of these different sort of uh, groups, of people and these different projects going along and kind of said, this is, their, this is the reality of what they're dealing with. And I brought it back to the, you know, the, the organization said oh you know like everyone's got their own you know realities and they see things in their own way and it was like no motherfucker <laughs> this is the reality this is the situation we need to fucking fix this situation right now like, as you, it is yeah. rather than conforming yeah. as in conforming away from your truth yeah and going i'll just conform I'll make, to I'll what the tribe yeah. is saying or what the company yeah. is saying i will yeah. Oh, yes, sir. Make believe time's over. Yes, you know? sir. The, the, you know, the, the reality. Everyone's got their realities, but no. Like you, you sat, you, you sat with your truth, and you said, "No, this is the true reality of what's happening." And you were true to yourself and said, "No, I need to make that statement." Yeah. And so, by you owning yourself, and all, as people start to own themselves, it creates relationships, and it creates interpersonal relationships that are based on honesty. Mm. And when you create something that's on honesty, it really states that um, you end up becoming more congruent towards the end goal. You mm. actually become more authentic towards the end goal. Yeah. Because as soon as you start becoming inauthentic or not true to yourself, yeah. unfortunately, the direction of that relationship, whether it's business, personal, um, even just a simple uh, relationship between friends would yeah. uh, transpire as being false because both if either one of you have not come in with your true self, then who are you really friends with? Yeah. 
Exactly. You're, yeah. You've so destroyed that's the, the relationship. Yeah. The imaginary. And the thing is, if we, it, it wasn't even from a place of ego the, that, that I confronted that person. It was just, this problem needs to be solved. There are people stressing out and actually Reliance suffering almost, yeah. Yeah, and, and, and having pain because of the situation. It needs to be solved. So this is the freaking reality. Regardless of what you want it to be, this is the reality of the situation right now. I know it's not a part of your bigger plans and things didn't go according to plan, but for us to address this properly, we need to actually start playing in reality and I think that's something that we can all do. Correct. Awesome. On our truth. Yes, yes. There we go. Awesome, Bob. There we go, fantastic. Thank you. Thanks guys, thanks for joining us. Share this around for anyone else who maybe needs to own their own reality, own their own truth. Leave us a comment. Whether you agree, disagree, whether you have a different um, opinion, please leave it down below. Let us know what you think. And as always, remember, decide your destiny. Cheers. See you guys.